Um, I started in 2009 having severe back issues and I had several doctors that I had gone to see and all of them basically told me it was all in my mind. It's really frustrating and I, I just kept going because I knew I couldn't walk. I was uh, at the time approximately 52 years old walking like I was 92. So, you know, it was, it was really bad. And my first visit with her, she looked at my MRI, pointed out exactly what the problem was, uh, gave me a little time to um, decide if, if I wanted to have surgery and the rest is history. I was very excited. And not only that, I had three other people recommend her to me. So, I mean, I, I would definitely recommend. In fact, I sent my husband, I sent my niece. <laughs> so, um, yeah. No, I don't. I'm, I'm shy, really. Yeah. Okay, his story is he'd had four previous surgeries. After having almost a head-on collision, he started experiencing leg pain and he didn't want to have surgery or anything, but he did. And uh, so once, you know, he saw Dr. McGregor the very same day, he jumped up out of, uh, out of bed in the hospital and they had to force him to use a wheelchair. He walked right out the door. And that evening I had to insist that he not drive and he's been on the go ever since. Right. Um, as you can see, well, we always smile, but uh, because of you, we're smiling together. We're not in pain. We're active. We're enjoying life. Billy's retired. I will be soon. And it's because of you. Yes, it is. <laughs>